This is but one of the legends of which the people speak. Long ago, there existed a kingdom where golden power lay hidden. They really, really liked eggs. It was a prosperous land, blessed with green forests, tall of mountains, and peace, and lots of vegetables. But, the, but one day, a man of great evil found the golden power and took it for himself. The great egg snatcher. With his strength at his command, he spread darkness across the kingdom. And the boiled eggs. But then, when all hope had died and the hour of doom seemed at hand, a young boy clothed in green appeared as if from nowhere. Wielding the blade of hero... Wielding the blade of evil's bane, he sealed the dark one away and gave the land light and eggs. This boy who traveled through time to save the land was known as the Hero of Time. There's a whole game about it, but we're not going to play it right now. The boy's tale was passed down through generations until it became legend. Wait, the game only came out how many years before then? Six years before? But then, a day came when a fell wind began to blow across the kingdom. The great evil that had thought had been forever sealed away by the hero. Once again crept forth from the depths of the earth, eager to resume its dark designs. People believed that the hero of time would come again to save them. They prayed to their egg gods, but none could help. But the hero did not appear, and they forever went hungry of eggs. Faced by an onslaught of evil, the people could do nothing but appeal to the gods. Eggy, Fleggy, and Flem. In their last hour as doom draw near, they left their future in the hands of fate. What became of the kingdom? None remain who know. The memory of the kingdom vanished, which leathered and survived on the breath of the breath of the, breath of the wind. The breath of the wind. It's a pretty nasty list you got there. You should get that checked out. Quiet. Once on a certain island, it became customary to garb boys in green when they came of age. What do you call that age? I think he's twelve, right? Yeah. Well, what's the first age? What's the age you got? You pull Clothed in green of the fields, they aspire to find the heroic blades that cast down evil. And. <laughs> and to slice up their eggs. <coughs> As you can see, he's under the myth. The elders of... wished only for the youths to know courage, like the hero of legend. <coughs> Said Island. You can see the one watchtower, the boat that's always here, the two houses that never go away. And the creepy little girl that sits there forever yelling for her brother. Oh my god, the seagulls are coming. You can see as she runs across the grass that she's looking for her big brother. There's a lazy sack of bones that we call. What do you want? Don't you hate it when your sister's creepy? I knew you'd be here! This is my favorite spot to gaze out at the sea when I play with the girls. I call it Ariel's Lookout. 
When I go up here, I call it Lookout from Ariel. So, do you remember what day it is? Uh, uh I can be to get away from you? Mm -hmm. You're still half asleep, aren't you? Half asleep, Hong Kong. Did you forget? Enough. I don't remember what happened last night. Big brother, it's your birthday! That's why I got so messed up. And that's why Grandma has been waiting for you to come back to the house. She's been waiting for a while now. It's a good thing I came to find you. Yeah. You should probably go home and see what Grandma wants. Don't you think? I don't think. I'm like... Well, actually, you're you're wrong. But... The great hero. Of... I might jump off and kill myself. You don't. You have to go down the ladder. You can jump off this, can't you? Nope. You can jump off now. Oh, that would have lost me a heart. Yeah. Well, I don't think they allow you to die off the first jump for reasons. For very particular reasons. Okay, I'll bring my grandma <clears throat> gift. Well, anyway, now that we're in the game, time to explain how this is going to work. So, um, we're gonna be, um, I am, I am Meister, and I am with my, 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 uh, idiot friend. Um, Steve. And he's with his idiot friend. Russ. And, and together... We are... I don't know. The retro something. I don't remember what our game channel is called. We can put a it, picture up in the top. I couldn't think of anything, so I just put our names there, with a fancy symbol in the middle, and called it a day. Can we get the coins first? Because um, I need to buy Grandma a gift, because she's a materialistic hog and doesn't like gifts from the heart. Well, this is what we're going to do. We're going to be uh, switching off from episode to episode. Yep. That ought to be fun. Yep. Um, oh, there's not that scary guy with the scythe anymore. Well, there's that scary guy who's watching... <laughs> so, uh, we're playing the oh, HD... Whoa! Hoi! Lunk! Press CL right here and use A to talk to me. Try it. Uh, how about no? Wait, this is the this is the tutorial, this is, isn't it? Yeah, it's still to lock on. Oh, it. I forgot that you were that ridiculous looking. That's correct. You're a smart one. You, my friend, have just targeted me. You see, when you press ZL, you can target certain objects. I, for one, use it quite often to talk to folks who are far away from me. Can I not talk to you and be Of more course, annoying? even if there isn't anything around, you can press ZO to target forward, you know. It's quite handy, indeed. Yep. There are myriad of other ways targeting as well. Quite an ingenious little thing, if I do say so myself. Yep, now leave me alone. Of course, that's not my only trick in my bag, not remotely. I can teach you a few things, more things, if you just climb up that ladder over there and drop by my room. But I have to go to Grandma's house. Um, he's gonna show you a few things if you stop by his room, okay? I don't know how to play the game. Wait, was this here in the original game? I don't think you need to actually do this. I'll do it anyway. This is my grandma. Don't forget to go underneath the house, though. Underneath the house? Yeah, I know. That's where his cool brother lives. No, oh. I mean underneath grandma's house. Oh, yeah, because there's an item down here, I think. Yeah. And then... You can watch this shot of Link's butt. A very rare one, because usually he's wearing other different pants. Um, I want to go... I want to go left. Oh. The only direction you can go. It is slightly different than I remember. I will say that. Slightly different. Oh, no, 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 no. No, not through the tunnel. Okay, I want to go in. Now hold four. There you go. You can stand up now, sir. Is this where we get the shield? No. This. Money! Is an orange rupee. Oh, well, hundred dollars. Here's your Enough. Hundred dollars in the beginning of the game. Yep. How big is my useful. wallet? Three hundred, right? I think so. It's been a while. See, I didn't play this game pretty much since it came out, so. Yeah, and I played. A but hey, we just got really long. What? I'm working on. Working on. Yeah, I'm not. Can't confess you're on your own. This reason, no worry, we're. I'll just get what I just found. Yeah, 
me, I... But that I was a while ago when it actually released, so I mean... Yeah, you can't do anything. You can't do anything. I, yeah, just I go in. Grandma. Just go in. Yeah, see Grandma. See, there's a few things different in this version. There's a few things different in this game there. It's just slightly different, and apparently there's a fast sale? Yeah. Uh, the fast sale, we'll get into that when we get to it, but... Ah, what a beautiful table. My China! Later, you can come here and get soup. Um... That's all Grandma knows how to do is bake soup. If you beat the game in, I think you can do a file where you don't actually get the heroes. Yep, you wear the pajamas. Well, those aren't pajamas. I, I have just... been waiting for you, Lunk. Lunk. Pretty dumb. I'm really fly. <coughs> I can't believe you're already old enough to wear these clothes. How did I measure you, ask? Well, we're not talking about that. You got the hero's clothes. They look like they might be a little warm for this weather. Here, that was the wrong wooden leg down because of the insult. Sorry, hit the ugly. Oh my gosh, I don't. Well, so you said, my luck. Don't look so disappointed, dear one. Just try them on, right in front of me. Today is a day to celebrate. It is the day that you become the same age as the young hero who has spoken in all the legends. You only have to wear for one day, so don't look so down. Be proud, child. In olden days, this was the day boys were finally considered to be men. It's like a bar mitzvah, but we're not Jewish. They were taught the ways of the sword to prepare them for battle with their enemies. But we do not live in such an age any longer. Our ways are the way of peace. Nowadays, I suppose Orca is the only one on the island who still knows anything about sword play. Hanging the family shield on the wall is decoration. It is another tradition that has been carried down from those days. Wow, you just got changed and got naked in front of his grandma. Mm-hmm. It's a little weird. Does all this make sense to you? Good, you know it doesn't to me. Is that nice, Lunk? They suit you perfectly. A perfect fit. Getting back to how I measured you. We'll talk about that. Well, tonight I'm glad to be invite the whole town over for your birthday party. So I'd better start getting ready, shouldn't I? Your grandma's going to make your favorite soup for tonight. Mmm! I just know you're looking forward to it. Now go, get your sister, Ariel. Wait, she's being all happy and everything. That does, that can't mean anything. Wait a minute, what's this? How do you look again? How do you look in first person? Well, here's what you can do. Oh, that's Link in that. I, yeah. I thought that was Link's uh, dad. I just stole the controller for a second because I want to try something. Yep, oh, it works. Flips. <laughs> yep, you can do it in the house. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we have to go outside. And... Off to go fight battles with High Rule. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Rule, how are you? This isn't High Rule, though. I mean, that kingdom. This is obviously him. supposed to be something like. What is it? This is supposed to be like Hawaii, isn't it? I don't know. I mean, That's what I thought it was. <laughs> I'm suppose I suppose that could be what it's all based after, but this is a Japanese game. It could just be based after some, you know. She's really she's gonna make you pay money if you talk to her. Don't talk to her. Good job. How much did she take? Ten rupees. That's how much those jars cost. Yeah. Okay, now I gotta go get Ariel. Yeah. Did she wander the dark yeah. deep forest? Yeah. No, that hasn't happened yet. You have to go back up to the tower. Oh, okay. The lookout tower. Well, I guess the only thing I can do now is jump. The other way. How am I not losing hearts? I think it doesn't allow you to until you get like a sword and a shield. Hmm. Oh, here's where's no, that's not Zill. Zill's the one with the booger hanging out of his nose. Yeah, you saw him earlier. Wow! I hope I'm gonna jump back here today, it's Lunk. It's Lunk to you, mister. It's Mr. Lunk to you! He loves his rock music. Here's a booger. Oh, oh, oh. Can I hope this blows hot? 
Please don't try to seduce me. I don't remember him looking that weird in the game. Ah, here's the creepy guy with the sight that I was talking about. Um, yeah. Mm. Please don't kill me. Okay, now I gotta go find my little sister. Yep, up at that tower over there. Where the birds are trying to eat her flesh. Yeah, that is one thing about Ariel in these games, if you never... The birds always flock around her. Yep. That... I used to have the book for this. I don't know where it went. She is Birdman. So, um... We're about to talk to my little sister. She's kind of ugly. Oh. Achoo! Hard for that cut. No, she stole it from my measurements that she took while I was naked. Oh, but wow, you look like you'd be way too hot in these clothes. Why is everyone saying I'm hot? Oh, sisters. Especially little people. I guess they're pretty neat though. Well, they are clean, I just got them. So em. anyway, Blunk, can you close your eyes and hold out your hand? Just for a sec. Okay. I'm gonna give you my most treasured belonging. But just for one day. You mean for the entire adventure? Happy birthday! You got the telescope. This is his most precious belonging. Treasure it dearly. Set it to Y, X, or R. Use it by pressing whatever button you set it to. Do it now and you can see what it sees. Using the gamepad, you can always touch and slide items to see them. So pretty much what it's saying is down on the gamepad, which... Which I can't use right now. Which, yeah, you're still okay. I'm ready to burn spare the game because you're about to be burned to lock and tee hee hee. Okay, let's go on. So, um, I'm gonna be keeping this oh, for the entire adventure. Oh, why are you trying it out right now? Look over there. Okay. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, so what you can do, pretty much, is you can just do that. Right there. You just click and drag and I it. I hit Y. And, um, now I have... Ooh, use the, um, gyro control. You can shut that off if you don't like it. It's alright. It kind of adds a sense of... Interestingness. So that's a rock. Yeah. Uh, we can spy on that some... What the? Oh yeah, you're supposed to stare at him. Yeah. Whoa! Well, this looks weird, doesn't he? Yeah. Okay, so you have to look straight up in the sky, or he's just gonna go bonkers like that for the rest of the game. Ah! It's the bird that steals my sister later! I mean... It steals the other girl! That's totally not a character! He's obviously just some side character that we're never gonna meet. Yeah. Here are the pirates. And there's a uh, Captain Hook's noble fleet. Ah, uh, we're a pirate. And uh, there's a bird. Just stole some poor defenses little child. Probably gonna eat it. Yeah. <laughs> That's the Kagarok, right? I don't remember the name of that enemy. I love this scene. <laughs> it like looks, looks rock, at it. Like... <gasps> and then he gets hit. And she's dead. Totally. Long, this is so terrible. That girl fell into the forest. She needs help. What happened to your voice? Never mind that. But it's too dangerous for you to go in there without something you can use to defend yourself. We well, have a telescope. Can I just kill him with this telescope? You might be able to backflip off this. I was gonna try. That was. Magic. Very, very amazing. That was perfectly aimed. Um, now you gotta find the sword. Welcome, right? I gotta go talk to the swordsman. Probably. Oh, oh no, Grandpa <laughs> gives me shields. Yeah. I think you need to get the sword first, though. No, wait, you don't get the shield yet. You just get the sword. Oh, yeah, then you get the... Yeah, you just have to get the sword. Is this guy trying... Is... Oh, yeah, this guy's trying to get the pig. <laughs> Pig. Um, I got your pig. I just saw a wild, a wild pig! Oh, see, look, that black one over there. That's racist. Don't you see him? That's perfect. My wife just told me what she really wanted a pet. You really go grab it, Lunk. Now you can just run up. Pigs are too loud alert to the senses to jog like, up and grab for one. If you want to get close to one, you just have to use the buttons. 
slowly up behind it. Slowly. You can also distract it with bait, I guess. You're creepy. Please don't hurt me. Okay, so you want to turn left! And go to Creepy Swordsman. Mm hmm This is Orca. Not, he's not a whale. He's actually pretty tiny. And he's also not Orcane. Oh, what's the matter, Lonk? You have urgent look about you. Has something happened, man? Whatever it is, from the look on your face, I suspect it's no laughing matter. What do you say, Lunk? Uh, have you come for some serious instruction in the way of the sword? I came to get the sword because it's part of my quest and I need to save my little sister because the video game requires it. And if I beat him, I get the sword, right? Yeah, man. Very good. Your first lesson shall be the horizontal slice. Face me and press. Good. Keep coming at me until you hear me say very good. Very good. Next is the vertical slice. Hold the L to target me. And when then press B. Do we have to go through this whole thing? I, I know how to fight. I played the game already. Keep swinging, man. Oh, yeah. there you go. No, I want to do the verse. Yeah, that's, that's, that's oh. Target with ZL and press B. <laughs> ZL, okay. Very good, keep thrusting. Uh, I'm just gonna leave. Please don't follow me. Next is the spin attack. Hold B briefly to build up strength, then release it. Or rotate and press B. Just like in the old games. Oh. Oh, my sword doesn't have a little bing at the end. Very good, more. Keep it up. It's Next is harder. This is the parry attack. So pretty much you just have to lock onto him until it says A. That's not A. That's B. Oh. To do a backslash. Use that. Well, on big it does guys. a variety of different things. It's like a action command. Well, I guess it sees him as like a dark nut, because that's the move you use on yeah. a dark nut. Well, you can also do the one where you jump over and you do the helmet, the helm splitter. That's not it. Oh wait, yeah, that is the one you're supposed to be doing. That was a fine display. So where do I get those hero belts from? And yet I sense certain anxiousness in the sword you hold, an eagerness that goes far beyond mere desire to be wielding it on the fields of battle. It's just a training sword. I do not know what has happened. It's a training sword. But I have faith in you somehow. I doubt you will misuse that sword. May you have it, Lunk. I give it to you freely. Take the blade with you. You accepted the hero sword with B. Use it wisely and carefully, you don't want it to let the kind old man you entrusted to. Since the olden days, this sword has been useful to fend off evil. Its blade is infused with the desire to become strong and righteous. However, it's not the master sword, which is the evil bane. Be strong, Lunk. But you have the end of the game, right? We're like, near the end of the game. And I think that'll end this episode right here. So, tune in next time for more of Lunk's adventure in... In Hyzul. Hey, you want to learn how to piss off the brother that lives upstairs? Yeah.